today we have the completed automatic scoring. So this is part two of the automatic scoring videos. If you guys haven't seen the first part, go watch that video before you watch this one. So now I'm going to explain what we did to change it to be completely automatic. So what we did is we added infrared beams that go on each side of the lane. Now these infrared beams come back and they're hooked to what's called an Arduino Leonardo. And a long story short, what this does is it types S for us so that it will score on open score. I'll briefly explain what's going on. So when the ball is rolled, it will break the infrared beam. Then that will come back to the Arduino. But, and once that information gets back to the Arduino, the Arduino will wait two seconds from the infrared beam being broken and it will type S on my computer. It does not physically hit the S key. What we did is we coded the Arduino to hit the S key. And this was the very tricky part of this whole process. I do not know how to code. So we had to get a code from someone else. His name is John, I'll link his channel in the description. And we tweaked his code to fit exactly what I needed. And I will put the code that we used in the comment section so you guys can copy and paste it and use it all you want. And you guys can also find links in the description to the infrared beams and the Arduino. I'll also leave a link to the webcam I'm using. So here are a few shots using the automatic scoring. So I don't know how well I explained everything, so if you're looking to put this on your mini lane and you need help, just ask and I'll try and help you the best I can. And there's only one downside to the setup that we have, and that's if, if the ball goes past the sensor in the gutter, it will not trigger the sensor. And this is due to the ball not being tall enough. And what we were going to do was cut out like a half circle with the hole saw, so that the lasers would be level with the lane almost but the ball still isn't as tall as the lane, so that still wouldn't have worked. So yeah guys, that's basically it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one.